Welcome to Bad Food Blog, and we're trying something fun. Coconuts. Coconuts. These are organic coconuts, and look what we have to do. We have to poke a hole in the logo, above the logo, insert a straw, drink it, crack it, open it, and with a knife we can take out a coconut and we can eat it. This looks fun. And then also we're going to cook this and try it as well, which is a Plant Pioneers no chorizo pepper thing. Yeah. We don't know how this is going to be, but we're expecting it to be pretty tasty because so Plant Pioneers... Are we... do the coconut first? Yeah, let's do the coconut first. So we're both opening the coconut. Let's change the camera angle. So... I do not think this is a coconut. It looks more like a bowling ball. It does look like a bowling ball. Let's read the instructions again. Oh, it's got a little tray, look. Easy, poke ball, in thing, drink. But which one? That's a stick. Bamboo yeah, this stick. This is a stick. We have to poke the hole, then we in, drink. Yeah, 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 yeah. We have to poke a hole, but where do we poke the hole? In the one, that one? Just well, one of these. nearest to the logo, I think. To the top one. Yeah. Well, this, this is not. Oh wow. oh, wow. So this is what we have to poke the hole with. Can you see that? It's, a, it's like a bamboo spike. Oh, oh, it might fizzed. Oh, just poke a hole all the way through. There you go, and pull it out. Oh, there we go. See, I got a hole all the way. See that? There's a hole in mine. I hear water. Yeah, I do too. I heard water before that, though. Now I get the straw. Well, I'm not wrong. Oh, crap. My one's smushed. My one, too. So you're, I can't get my straw through. Me neither. I gotta make the hole bigger by squishing it around. Well, don't turn it like that, you'll end up with coconut bits in there. Here we go. There we go. So now I'm going to drink this. I have coconut with a straw in. That looks like a cartoon a comic book bomb, right? <laughs> or it looks like a cartoon coconut. Oh, ah, coconut water tastes weird. Not for me. Not my straw. <sighs> oh, well. No, 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 just stick it in. It'll still work. It, it dropped on the floor. It's dirty. Yeah, it's fine. It's not going to kill you. I don't trust it anymore. No, look, I've done it. I've straightened it out for you. There you go. It won't stick through. No, no, stop, stop drilling because you're putting lots of bits in there. Okay. Why don't you get glass and pour it out? I'd clear all the bits away first, if I were you. Milk. Here, see, get rid of those bits first. Okay. Oh, if you want to pour it out quickly, maybe make two holes. I'm going to do the same. I don't want to drink it for the straw. The straw tastes awful. Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll poke two holes in it. Yeah, because then one. This one bigger. No, no, no! Just poke two holes. Uh, oh, right. The other ones aren't holes. We're outside, and a cat is really interested in what we're about to do. What are you about to do? Bash it. And, uh, you know, turn it on its side, and then hit it with the bit with the the more yeah the other bit. No, the other side. Why? Yeah, and then smack it really hard and see if it opens. Did that it crack? Did nothing. That did nothing. Okay, Ooh, do it I again. You, you start the side. Whoa, that did something. Hit it one more time. Okay. I heard a clip cloppy sound there. One more time. Whoa! Yes! Now bring them up and show the camera. Pure coconut. I'm just going to put this on the side. Wow, that's the inside of a coconut. Get the other bit. All right, go and do mine. Bring mine out and let's do mine too. Yeah. The second time. The one's more like an acorn shape, so it's harder. Yeah, I might have to hold it and hit it at the same time. Harder. Oh, a bit harder, I think. Okay. Max, on the... Yeah, not I'm on trying. the. No, hit it down into the floor, not sideways. That's it. And again. And again. There we go. Hey, 
cool. That one looks cool as well. It took a bit. It took a bit longer. It's like a very alien shape inside, isn't it? It's not an alien shape. It's a coconut. Should we try some? Hey, you can break it off. Break off a bit. Yep, it tastes exactly as I remember as from when I was a kid. Mm -mm. You think it tastes nice? I never liked it. It's not very sweet. It's very fibrous. It tastes a lot like coconut, obviously. It's very oh. creamy and milky. I'm going to try to break a bit off so I can eat it. Now, Max, get a knife and just pull it out from the inside. It comes off really easy from the inside shelf. Okay. No, no, not outside. Let's go inside. Come on. Okay. Max does that and gets some of his coconut out gently to try and eat. You want to start from the edge, really, and cut it. No, sort of prise it out from the edge. Oh, don't worry about it. You gotta be careful. It's only a steak knife, he's not gonna injure himself. This Let's have a, a look at this pizza. This is a no chorizo grilled peppers pizza. And here you go, those are the vital statistics. You wanna pause it there. Allergens are wheat, 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 and wheat. Wow, well, wheat. And that's what it looks like. So it looks a lot more appetizing there than it does there. But these things are usually pretty good from this company. But I'm surprised by the size because quite clearly it could have come Sheesh. with a box a lot smaller. Ouch. Uh, you cut your finger. Okay, no, stop I, doing that's that. That's not cutting. I was holding down on this. Oh, the back of the blade. You've dented your finger. Okay. Right, well, lots of the no chorizo is all in one place. So this is going to go in the oven and we're going to see what this looks like in, I think, approximately 12 to 15 minutes. So in it goes. Top of the oven, of course. This really has become a separate video from the coconut thing. See the previous video. But here we are. Hmm. No chorizo, chorizo pizza is cooked. It has done the time it's done and it's gone brown, but crispy. But the thing is this vegan cheese never really properly crisps up. So I think that's about as good as it's going to get. And it is never going to be this good again. Sorry, that's a line from the film. That's as good as it gets, and it's never going to be that good again. It's from True Romance. There we go, right. All right, let's try it. Du, 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 du. Get a plate first. I'm not sure what this is going to taste like. It's still very, very hot. I had to get a plate for Max as well. And let's see what this tastes like then. First of all, let's try one of these no chorizo chorizo pieces. They're okay. Mmm. It tastes like a one pound pizza with chili oil on. Mmm. In the vegan dough, probably doesn't taste too bad. They put quite a bit of spice on everything. Hmm. It tastes all right. I mean, if you're vegan, this is probably a good option. In terms of saturated fat, sugar and salt, it's not too bad either. So, hmm. None of them in the red. A lot of saturated fat for something without meat though. Well, certainly okay. I would certainly buy this again if I was a vegetarian, but because I have the option to eat meat, I probably won't. Thanks for watching. Please like and share the video. And if you like what I do here, please subscribe. Wow, that was a long video.